Hey everybody, it's Party Elite. Welcome you back to another episode of our Total War Three Kingdoms Records mode. Let's play as the Kingdom of T. This session we are going to kick things off by fending off these offenders. So many fen puns. Hopefully, hopefully they work out for us. Um, we, we need to try and destroy this army. I don't think it's going to happen. Tsangwu might fall, but we're going to cause as much damage as possible before it does. We do have Shinren and Kong Fen's army barreling down south to take the city back should it fall. Uh, but we will make a valiant effort at keeping it. Let's dive on in, kick things off with some action today, and uh, hopefully have a wonderful time. All right. Let's see what we can do, folks. This is going to be bad. We've already got a couple of gaps in the walls. These towers have been taken out. Uh, we could pull back a little bit and use some of these towers to protect us instead. We have some towers out over here that might be firing away, which is all well and good. But they're, they're going to make their ways in, aren't they? Yeah, we're not going to succeed over here. I mean, we do have a couple of towers back over here as well. I'm almost tempted to fall back into this central area rather than try and fight out front. See, because back in the central area, we can try and funnel them, I suppose. Maybe. This might be crazy. Like, I might be... I might. This might be crazy talk, right? But let's see. There's strategist over here. Wen Gong. Level 4. Wonder if we're going to be seeing fire arrows and stuff. Because that could be a problem for our towers. But see, we could we could funnel them. See, we'll have these towers firing away as they make their approach. That would be quite helpful. They'll fire everywhere. Um, up over here, this... Nope, all the gatehouses are down. Like, we, the gatehouses belong to us, but they're, uh, they're not going to be shooting. Holding these lines, they'll be really clumped up, but... Got some overlapping fields of fire that we could take advantage of, maybe. I don't know. This is a little nerve-wracking. We can block some of these paths, right? You guys are probably going to swing through the gaps. Um, they'll break through any of, the, any of the obstacles if they wanted to. We try and hold the line here, I suppose. We'll stop their approach from there. Try to hold over here, maybe. Um, now let's leave that open. Try to block these off, maybe. These, I do not know. Do not know the ideal approach over here. Block that off. Buy me some time for rear charges and stuff coming through. Uh, you know, we could... Oh, no, that's all the barricades. Okay, so then what we could do is... Yikes. The overlap is over here, unfortunately, which would leave them open to capturing the tower, which I obviously don't want. Over here, the overlap is over here, but they have no reason to go all the way there. Um, so let's go ahead and deploy you over here. Right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to put you guys over there. We're going to get you three over here. Able to fire away from a pretty safe distance. Get some damage in, hopefully. Maybe get enough damage in, question mark. Maybe, perhaps. We also have this tower over here able to provide some support. If it doesn't get captured, it will be providing fire support, you know, in this area as they move towards us. So that should hopefully soften them up a little bit. Then we hold the line and we get our cavalry. Get our cavalry to move in and around. Now their archers are all over there, so that's a little scary. I could keep my cab over here, send it around the long way for some rear charges and stuff. Sure, let's try it, folks. I I don't have any delusions. I don't think we're winning this one, if I'm completely honest. But uh, we're we're gonna put up a good damn fight, that's for sure. That's for sure. Let's begin. Let's begin uh, defending. I think defending these walls would have been a foolish idea. For those of you that are uh, wondering what the hell I'm doing, we don't have any tower support. Um, yes, they'll be packed up against, you know, the edges, but, or they'll be packed, but, you know, we're dealing with axes. Uh, we've got cavalry that could come charging through. Like, there's a lot to worry about. There's a lot to worry about. Um, okay, you do have charge reflection. Okay, just want to make sure. Yeah, tower's able to fire away. Some work done at some of these saber militia, maybe. 
yeah, swords, axes, all that stuff against my spears, it would have been hopeless. It would have been cut down very quickly. My archers would have been causing more friendly fire than anything else. My towers wouldn't be helping. This is definitely, I think, the way to go. Now, whether it's actually going to work out for me or not, that's a whole different question, but we'll find out. We'll find out. You moving in towards the gate? Oh, poor guy. You don't have to be here. You don't have to fight. You don't have to fight. <laughs> Give up. Pointlessly dying for the enemy. Like, for, 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 you know, the wrong cause. Fortunately, they can use loose formations, but okay, we're getting, you know, some kills in there. Yeah, they're on the walls, they're coming through, like, they're going to come in from every direction. Have you been firing? You have been firing. Trying to cause some hurt there, fair enough. Here they come, filtering through. All right, all right, all right. Good stuff, good stuff. Clump through. I wish I had some trebuchet or something over here. Anything to help defend. Just a matter of time. A matter of causing damage, I guess. I guess that's just it. I want to cause some hurt so that when uh, husband and wife arrive, they'll see the results of the courage of their men. Okay, here they come. They're capturing that gatehouse. Good for you. Far away over here. Alright, here they come from every direction. From as many directions as they can, at least. Go ahead and get you over there. The axe band will be arriving first, I think. Here they come. They'll get these towers pretty easily, I think. Got the gates. Come on. Any second we should be able to start firing. Getting in a position over here. Gonna wait until the cavalry's kind of left itself out in the open. Or not the cavalry, until the archers have left themselves out in the open. There we go, archers firing. They do have some block chances, but... One, excellent. Are firing over here. These guys are going to loose formation. Fair enough. Still taking a lot of damage, though. Okay, we're going to eat a charge over here. We do have charge reflection versus mounted, so hopefully some of these fools come charging towards me. Uh, let's start firing. Keep firing at the axe band. You guys are all clumped up. Are we firing? Hope so. Right, Axe Band has taken a fair bit of damage. In come some of the charges now. Our towers are able to assist as well. And fire here. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Axe is not having a good time. I love it. Cavalry is the time to activate. So much range over there. Like melt. That's my concern. Of course, we have to. Fire up over here, archers. Good stuff. The cavalry is giving up over there. Worried about that axe band. The warriors are running. Beautiful. Fire over here. You don't have coverage. Nope. Alright, we're holding. We're holding. Fire over there. Fire over here. Come on. Let's do it. In we go. In we go. All those archers turning around. They're going to capture this tower. No problem. Right, firing away over here. Tempted to actually fire at uh, Shu Du. In comes another charge, it looks like. Push through, push through. If we can get through there into those uh, archers, that'd be helpful. Go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Yeah, Shudu's not having a good time. Enemy's giving up over here. Charge up there. Oh, give me a nice charge. Give me a nice charge. Okay, got some hits in. Let's pull out. we firing up there. This tower's been taken. This tower's about to be taken as well. Archers are almost out of ammunition. Let's go ahead and fire over here. Pull you down. Maybe we can get like a rear charge in here. Help these guys out. 
Firing. Firing, let's go. Are you down? Let's go, let's go. Oh dear, here they come. Gotta fire that way. Go. Got a rear charge here. I should have pushed up there instead, maybe. It is what it is. This cavalry is not even going to get in, looks like. Firing on to fire. Let's go. I don't think I can free these guys up. Let's go ahead and move the spears over this way. Pull back. It's a useless trade of shots. Okay, here they come for some more charges. We're able to fire. Kill their goddamn generals. You up, move you up, let's go. Yeah, this is not going well for us. They're unfortunately going to capture this very easily. Go. Fire away. At least we've caused some damage, though. We've caused a fair bit of damage, I think. No, fire this way. Into this clump. Scare this nonsense off. Alright. I doubt they're going to come towards us. Let's pull back up this way. Moving in towards the city center. Come on, get up here. Oh, their archers are getting so much work done. Still firing there, okay. Dive in here, gotta hold that line. He's being taken. Trying to waver a little bit over here, that's good. Oh, we're losing this. This tower has been so helpful and we're about to lose it. Here's over here, can move up. This tower needs to hold. Oh, it's not going to. Oh, it most certainly is not going to. Alright, I mean, this is about what I predicted. Didn't, didn't expect to win this. Go ahead and fight over here. I'll go ahead and send you over here. Hold on. Why'd I do that the other way around? Go, 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 go. Gotta hold on to this tower. Ah, we're, we're done. We're done. This is over. This is over. Just a matter of uh, a little bit of damage here and there now. Close defeat. Ah, well, we did our best. We did our best. I, I, I think that's probably the best uh, end we could have hoped for. Caused a fair bit of damage. Unfortunately, they'll be able to recover a fair bit, I think. We did manage to eliminate one unit at the very least. Maybe two will need some time to, to get back. Three, perhaps. Two, okay. And we did kill uh, their, their strategist over here. You know what? That wasn't terrible. Just under half the army was destroyed. Considering our circumstances, okay. Not very happy about it. We'll take that city back in no time. There is so much going on this session. Okay, okay, okay. Lost the farmland up there. Oh, hello! Whoa, wait a second. This is the Sun Tuen. Deng Ningxin has been succeeded by Sun Tuen. What? <laughs> Alright, I guess this faction is back. Question mark? Back. You know what I mean. That's so weird. All right, the Kingdom of Ba and the Han Empire have signed a peace treaty. We've lost Tsang Wu. Yep. Tiger, tiger. A tiger prowling in the camp panics the guards. Their screams awake your general, who leaps from their tent, half-dressed, and wrestles the beast to the ground until it is properly subdued. Moments later, another tiger's roar is heard, but it turns out to be the contented snores of your general coming from his tent. Inspiring presence from Tao Yun. <laughs> All right, Tao Yun. Good for you, buddy. Good for you. Getting ready for this attack on the fishing port, I suppose. Wrestling tigers. Uh, okay. So we lost Ying Chen to Gong Lang Shu. Very upset about that. Because uh, we eliminated them, so to speak. But they're back now. And Sun Ren and Kong Fen over here barreling down. Now, some of you mentioned in the comments that I have good armor for Kong Fen um, available. We've got the Instructor's Leather on. I guess I could swap it out. But this is worse armor. And this is already being used by Kong Fen. So, not sure if I missed something or... Or if you're referring to something else, but hopefully I've got that covered. Oh, hello. I got a better sword for him, though. The Heavenly Sword. I believe that's from Yuan Shu. It only makes sense. Or Yuan Yao, sorry. 
only makes sense that uh, it goes to Kong Fen. And we are just short of being able to attack this turn, unfortunately. We want to make sure we get as close as possible, though. Perhaps we rush down. It's weird because I wouldn't mind them pushing out of the city. I wouldn't mind giving them some room to leave the city. So that's something to think about. Up over here as well, there's a bit of insanity. Oh my god, I forgot about this army. Oh dear, okay. We don't have the money to uh, build massive defenses or anything. This was also unfortunate. We should be able to push up and maybe engage these guys, but they'll probably retreat. Puts us in an awkward situation. Over here, what have we got going on? Some serious silliness. Some serious silliness. Now, before I do continue, I just want to mention really quickly, if you've been enjoying this series and you've been enjoying Total War Three Kingdoms on this channel and you'd like to see more, please do not hesitate to let me know by dropping a like and a comment down below. It really does help me just understand what you'd like to see more or less of on the channel. It helps you make some decisions for the channel as well. It's great to see the enthusiasm and it's always fun to read the comments. I think that's also a very big part of it. I enjoy reading the comments thoroughly. Uh, so yeah, do keep them coming. We've got a couple of stories being uh, written in the comments as well. Always a joy to read. Uh, you know the analysis of everything that goes down from the you know perspective of like a a poet or a, or a council member, things like that. I find those very interesting as well. So yeah, do keep them coming, please, and thank you. Now, what's going on over here? Uh, just attempting to infiltrate. Fair enough. What is Kingdom of Ba's holdings? Like they are kind. Of, oh my God, Tufa Tong is huge. If this is unless they've confederated, like they did with Her Yi, they're pretty big pretty big and we are maybe able to get peace with these guys again they don't hate us it is trending negatively but holy crap i remember them asking for less if i if i recall correctly oh man oh man okay 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 oh we've got uh lang yuning and chang ro education program and counteract corruption coming back from beihai Gotta make sure I stay on top of that because the counteract corruption is going to be helpful <laughs> financially. Traits gain. Kong Fen is dutiful. Okay, good stuff. And Ken Cao Cao is bright. Yeah, I'd say. Good. I, he needs to get cunning, so that's good. Xun Ren and Ken Cao Cao and Kong Fen and Sun Ren have become friends. It's good that Kong Fen and Sun Ren like each other. And on that note, actually, some of you have pointed out quite rightfully that maybe it's time for my brother... To get married where is he kong b should maybe get married however we don't have money to spare right now for his marriage um and i don't know if we have anybody available okay lang yoning don't know if if he's worthy of something more i think all right let's start some of the action off over here how do we want to how do we want to deal with our situations over here, we got to take the farmland back. You'll be able to, well, in like two turns, you'll be able to get down there, I guess, because we got to cross the river first, unfortunately. Shouldn't be a problem, though. These two strategists have done quite well. We should be able to overpower the enemy uh, over here, hopefully, without too much trouble. They will try to recruit, I imagine. So as long as we get close, uh, we'll be able to prevent the recruitment from getting too hefty, so to speak. Down over here, you know what? Let's start with uh, Ken Cao Cao. Let's go ahead and hit Dong Hai. Get the fishing port, and then how long will it take us from up there? Another, like, two turns after that to take uh, Guangling's farmlands. Fair enough. Let's go ahead and kick this off, though. Trying to make another sunset. Make it a night battle. Decisive victory. Low predicted casualties. Do I trust the AI is the question. I think the answer is no, folks. Just because um, you never know what they're going to cause hurt to with their low predicted casualties. You know what? I'll trust the AI this time. I'll do it. Let's do it. Let's take let's take a risk in life. Right? Let's go ahead and delegate and hopefully it's not gonna go too poorly. Holy crap. I was expecting like a handful of deaths at most. That's way too much. Why did I do that? Ah, uh, I did that so that we could make some more progress in today's session. That's why I actually did that, but you know what? We'll recover in a turn. That's what I was hoping. I was hoping that the number of deaths would be counteracted by our recovery rate, our replenishment rate. Dao Yun has leveled up. Let's go ahead and give you, what, intensity? No, no, no. Let's go ahead and give you ability. Nope. 
Sentinel and Diligence might not be a bad idea. Extra melee evasion for melee infantry in the retinue. Yeah, that feels like the right call over here. Go with that. Helps our expertise as well. Good stuff. Oh, you leveled up too. Oh, dang. Do you have... Yeah, okay. This is as fancy as our equipment gets, unfortunately. We can get you a better horse. And up your authority a little bit. Hmm. Helps unit morale, sure. All right, what do we give you? Mobility? Trust? Armor for all spear infantry. That sounds like a good idea. Plus eight resolve as well. Bigger uh, bodyguard unit. Apply that. Cool. Very cool. Yeah, these guys will get crushed pretty easily. That won't be a problem. Now, you. What do we do with you? The Yangzhou livestock farm is just out of reach, so I guess we'll go after the large town. Shouldn't be a problem there. Boxing Tufa Tong in down over here. Sure, yeah, let's go for that. Bring you down here. We might actually need to fight this one. It is a town. Don't stop. I know where I'm sending you. <laughs> uh, Peric victory. Yeah, yeah, we definitely have to fight this one. There's actually a, a bit of a garrison here. What was it? Oh, I guess he's the administrator of the region. Uh, okay. Shouldn't be too much of a problem. We've got trebuchet. We've got uh, arrow. I believe we have fire arrows and fire shots. They shouldn't have any walls or anything. They're just a town. Well, I mean, one way to find out. Well, we can demand their surrender first. See if they will accept. We'll offer an if outmatched by an opponent and demand it when they're... Okay. Oh, wow. I really wasn't expecting that. I, I thought they would res refuse against a, a Peric victory. Yeah, let's just occupy it. Excellent. Alright. Conquest with no death. I like that. Kingdom of Wei, come on. You... I'd love to even just get, like, a temporary peace, but it's not going to be happening. It's not going to be happening. Alright, up over here. Next, go ahead and move on into Xiangdang. Take that farmland back. Oh, when did the Kingdom of Wei get it? Hold on a second. Did that not belong to Fang Bing? Or, I guess, her Shumin now, but... The hell happened there? Some spycraft, perhaps? Or maybe they made a deal? I thought it looked weird in the uh, in the in the diplomatic screen, like when that clump happened. I was like, when did they get two places? I can't possibly be misremembering that badly. Anyway, that's besides the point, because the past is the past, and the future is this is going to be mine. Let's go ahead and delegate this. No need to fight this either. I don't think. Feels so weird being able to auto resolve again. Lost more than I would have liked to lose, especially over here. Yikes. But occupy that. Good stuff, good stuff. Okay, it'll take us a couple turns to recover. We gotta move towards a small town next. Ma Dai. Let's go ahead and push. So, Ma Dai's army composition comes up all the time. And, uh... You know what? It's, um... It's something I guess I've shot myself in the foot with a little bit, uh, in, in the sense that I know this isn't the perfect composition. We should probably get a strategist in here. We should probably get, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, strategist with a trebuchet and archers and stuff, get some range capabilities. But there's something about this army and the way it fights uh, that I've just grown attached to. So unless we find themselves being completely useless, like no field battles and stuff like that, uh, I don't think I'll change them up too much. I just, I've been enjoying, I hope you guys don't mind. I've just been enjoying this style. It kind of tells us a very different story. It makes Ma Dai a very different type of general um, that we can, again, you know, write tales about. Now, I actually got a very interesting suggestion that I missed uh, last time around because I recorded before the comment came through. So two, two sessions ago, I got this comment that suggested a name for one of our rank 10 cavalry. Let's go ahead with these guys over here because they're up top and there's more of them. Uh... Where are we? Where are we? Da, 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 da. Naming them Dai Lu Ma. Okay. Let's go ahead and rename them really quickly. Uh, usually I do this between sessions, but uh, it just occurred to me that I missed this. Uh, we do have a couple of rank 10 units, actually, so feel free to start getting some name ideas in there. We've got some sabers in here. Uh, we've got lots of spears over here. We've got uh, this cavalry unit as well. 
uh, but these guys are Dai Lu Ma, and apparently that is a pun of his name, which also symbolizes the cavalry that paves the way. If that's that's amazing, I don't know why I was saying if that. That's 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 great. I like it a lot. Ma Dai Dai Lu Ma. That means cav the cavalry that paves the way. He's got all the ca like that is spot on. Thank you for that suggestion. Now I have to be very careful about this unit and make sure it never gets hurt. <laughs> uh, all right, so that's that taken care of. I do believe we'll march up. Uh, I don't want to rush up. I do want to get the replenishment. We're just going to march up. Hopefully it'll stay at double pluses over here. Yeah, a little bit of a drop, but it's okay. In two turns, we should be fine. Cool, and then hopefully we'll be able to protect up there. This is a bit of a scary situation. Because I do believe I'll find myself outnumbered again. But thankfully, these guys aren't replenishing. I almost wonder if I should 3v1 them. Other options, of course, to get up over here and set up an ambush. They're likely to be coming up this way. And so I can go up to there. Set up an ambush. Anybody passing through will get ambushed. I just need to turn this around a little bit. And then up over here, what do I do with you? You are still replenishing. This army should be pretty good when it's ready to fight. Where would you be going through? Likely down there. I'd like to cut these armies off. They might take the river, though, is the other thing. Because that's the obvious path to take there. I could chase after this army. I could chase after this army. There's silk over here. And I have a spy over here. Wow, this became a full stack fast. They've got a lot of stacks coming our way. Okay, you know what? Let's, let's go ahead and push you up this way. This march, we need to get the, uh, the, the health back up. If I can catch up to Dong Tuan, great. If I can't, then we'll take the Silk Trader at Wudu. Um, I do need to figure out my spy over here. I mean... Build undercover network. Costs some cover. But it helps us build the network at a faster rate. Should I do that? I'm pretty sure at 30, don't we get... Um, we get a thing, I believe, at 30, which lets us uh, get the army to betray. We'll, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Um... They're still far away. When they become, when they get a bit closer, I think I'll try to activate them. All right, so that's taken care of. You're taken care of. You're taken care of. This is left. We have to get across. Go ahead and get into the water, and then cross, I guess, over here because they have their zone of control up to there. So let's go ahead and definitely want to be. Hmm. Do I want to lock them in? No. Make sure we can get out over here. This is where the map starts to really bother me. Let's get you over there. Oh, yeah, okay, good. This might become a 2v1. As long as it doesn't become a 3v1. That would be problematic. We'll find out. A 3v1 over there might be a bit of a problem. What is this? Ken Xiao Xiao and Cao Zhang. And then Zhao Yun and Cao Zhang became friends. Oh, I guess that's because of the... Uh, the battle they would have fought over there. Okay. Uh, I believe that's everything over here. Down over here, though. Let's go ahead and get this army. See, we can't set up an ambush. That would, I think, be too far away. We have to try and, like, get them to push towards us. So let's go all the way down to here. See if we can't convince them to sally forth and attack us. Fight them in an open field battle. Take them on that way. Uh, now again, I could spend some money, get some upgrades and stuff going on, but just worried about our income. Again, easy solution to that is this. And then we could... Get this out. Upgrade it. And upgrade one more step. Like. So. Gives us something of a garrison that needs to be replenished. But, you know, these guys will still take two turns to get here, I think. 
used up all of our money. No one is looking to rebel just yet. So we have at least one turn of higher taxes. Actually, we have a turn of max taxes. We do. Oh, no, we don't. Let's go ahead and keep it at that. Shall we? Just kind of slowly but surely push up. <laughs> slowly but surely. Uh, over here, Lady Wu, Sun Ling, you've leveled up. None of these guys are actually in action, so that's okay. I think we're done all of our moves. You've moved. You've all moved. Yep, yeah, I think we are. I believe that's the turn, folks. Yeah, let's see what the AI does. Um, hopefully nothing too crazy. Hopefully stuff crazy enough that we can take advantage of. Let's see. So Gong Lan Chu is pulling back. All right. Kingdom of Wei is pulling down south. Maybe getting aggressive. Oh, also pulling up north. Okay. Dong Tuan. Oh, hello. A Pyrrhic victory is predicted. I mean, then I'll just delegate it. I could probably make it better, but I'm trying to skip past some of these smaller battles today. So let's go ahead and delegate that. We better have won. Okay, good. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go ahead and get the replenishment, I think. No, actually, oh, goddamn. Uh, let's go ahead with the ransom. Hopefully we can close the gap here next turn. They're also suffering from attrition, so that's good. Are we at war with literally everybody? Wei Yuan Tzu, are you going to attack? Ufa Tung pulling down south. Pulling away, not getting baited in. Mm, that's too bad. That's too bad. They're pulling to the side there. Han Sin going in with another siege attempt. Oh, are you kidding me? That is going to be rough. It's like this again. Well, let's try it. To the battlefield we go. A decisive defeat is being predicted here, but maybe we can hold our ground. Quite a few archers. We'll see what we can do. To the battlefield we go. All right. The so reinforcements from over there. Buddy over here, very badly hurt already. Oh, is that seriously it? Okay. Interesting. Interesting. So let's go ahead and get uh, you up front. And then you back here. We'll get these swords over here just in case. Just in case he's able to close the gap there. I'm hoping my tower will be able to take that unit out without any trouble. Right? And we've got a bunch of archers. Able to sit over here and fire away as the enemy approaches, I suppose. Over there. Get you over here. Get you two back over here. Okay, and with our towers and our archers and maybe a flanking maneuver over here, hopefully we'll do well enough to hold these guys back. I think we should be able to. I think we should be able to, especially with this guy hopefully dropping basically right away, unless he pulls over to join the reinforcements, in which case he'll take a bit longer to take down, but he'll go down eventually anyway. All right, let's, uh, let's kick things off. Let's go ahead and begin. Come at me. Enemy reinforcements have arrived. That's okay. Their main army is about to fall. I don't know what they're thinking here, actually. Oh, I love watching cavalry drop to... Oh, amazing! A damn sniper towers over here. There we go. Down you go. And last one. Let's kill him. Let's kill him. Kill him. There we go. Beautiful. Now reinforcements have arrived. This is the scary part. This is the scary part. We'll make their way over. We'll be able to take care of those archers for the most part. Some of those archers are full health, unfortunately. Oh, don't come this way. Don't be like that. If you will come this way, then come where they overlap, please. Mm, I don't like this. Speed it up a little bit. Yeah, I need to adjust. Get you over here. Get you all over here. Hold on, actually. Let's get you all over here. And let's get you over here. Gotta get into position. 
That's why they're doing this, they're throwing me off. Keep you over here for a flanking opportunity, potentially. So ready for my defenses and now, uh, they're throwing me off, damn it. We're okay. We're okay, we're okay. Speed it up a little bit. Okay, good, we're already basically in position. I don't like the uh, gap over here. Pull up a little bit. We don't draw attention to these guys, but just want to make sure we're actually able to fire as soon as possible. Let's go ahead and move you up a little bit. You over as well. Alright, good stuff. Tower's able to fire? Almost. This tower is firing. Go ahead and hit those archers, please. You are also able to hit those archers. Good stuff. Let's try and get them to give up. Nice and early. They have split up their forces a little bit. God damn game, why are you doing this to me? Here, try and push through there. start firing away, I think. Go up here, let's go. Get these guys off. Okay. Archers are almost taken care of. Let's fire over here. There we go. Charge them. Get out of. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Go up over here. Get you over here. Firing away. Are eating a lot of damage of our own, unfortunately. Okay, hopefully we'll scare them off. Just out of reach there. Come on. The work done. Guys are still moving. Are you just gonna circle around all the way? Enemy unit flees. Excellent. A couple more we can scare off over here. Fire over there. As soon as they get into range, I want to be able to fire. Yeah, okay, good stuff. Good stuff. Pull back. Pull back. These guys are. Oh no. God damn it. Needed that to not happen. Fire away. What are you doing? Want to make sure these guys don't come back. Low on ammo. A little bit. Not a lot, but a little bit. Wondering if we pull back to the second line of defense instead. They're, they're, it looks like they're coming all the way around this way. Which, I mean, okay, fair enough. Pull you over, let's pull you over. Pull you over as well. Gotta go fast here. Gotta go fast. Archers, we can pull you back. Over here. Go. Gotta get in position. No idea what they're trying to do here. They're trying to find a gap, I guess. Still firing away. I don't imagine these guys will be coming back anytime soon. We could still lose this battle. Their numbers are... Well, they're numerous. Lots of archers, though, that we can probably scare off pretty easily. But lots of archers that can also scare us off pretty easily. Alright, let's go ahead and speed things up a little bit. Are you seriously going to go another step down? This one. Why are you doing this? Looks to be the case. Be down here. Go up over here. Okay. Fair enough. 
Go ahead and get the archers. Over here then, I guess. Trying to get me out of position, it feels like. I mean, they have done that. Beat it up again. I'm not going to sally forth. That would be stupid. That would just be dumb. Go and get you up here. Move you lot up over here. Just a little bit closer. Beat it up again. Gotta, it's got to be from this angle, right? Gotta be. If the if if it even is, if it even is, like if they're even planning on attacking, what are you doing? What is this nonsense? Why are you wasting time? <sighs> okay, here they come. There we go. Nicely clumped up. About to be within range. This tower will unfortunately be useless. We can pull you out over here. Get you going. Gotta move fast this time around. Far away. The number of archers scares me a little bit. It's a lot of archers. Firing away. The cavalry also scares me, if I'm completely honest. Move up. Get into position. You up a little bit. Ready to fire any second now. Go. Leave over this way. Okay, we're firing. Firing. I feel like we should fire at the uh, cavalry instead, before it gets a good charge or two in. Fire up there, let's go. A couple shots, alright, into the archers again, I think. Pull you back. Alright, how are we doing over here? Fire away, fire away, come on. You to fire over here. Warriors are running up front. Okay, good stuff. What are you doing? Fire back here. All oh, you to fire back there. Charge up. Have to. Okay. Pull you up a little bit. Try to scare these guys off. Let's get a couple of you firing up over here. Need to scare them off. Come on. These guys will hopefully get scared off. Okay. Firing down over here. Oh, wow. Pull you down. Let's go. Giving up. That's right. Surrender. Come on, damn it. Give up, damn it. Power over here. Take care of this guy. Come on. They're out of ammunition. Just fire away this guy. Finish him off. There we go. That might actually be the win. It should be the win, I think. Look at how slowly they're trying to get away. It's like, ah, get away. Holy. There it is. Okay. Well, let's, let's punish them for their attempts over here, though. Punish them a little bit at least. Starting to get a little worried. Starting to get a little worried. But well, we've done what needs doing here. Claim that victory. A heroic victory. Excellent. Excellent. Gonna take as many captive as I can. We did outnumber them, but again, they had like cavalry and stuff, so that was the scary part. And their weird maneuvering. I was just like, what are you doing? This is making me nervous. Alright, good. Down you go. A lot of killing over here. Oh, Tsai Pu. Hello. 
Um, could just employ them both. It's not all that expensive, but it does keep them out of the pool. I have so many people. I should just release them. They're low level. Yeah. I don't need more. Go. Uh, I wonder if we should... No, no, no. Hold on. I said I'm going to take the replenishment. Didn't I? I meant to say it. Because they might come back. Oh my god. Why are there so many armies here? Why are there so many goddamn armies here? Thanks. He's still getting aggressive over here. Okay, fair enough. Wow, very aggressive. Oh, hello. Interesting move. Interesting move. Wasn't expecting that. What happened down here? Nothing, eh? Yeah, they stayed put. Why would they move? We can attack them. We can try to starve them out. Well, let's go ahead and attack them at the very least. Because that's a necessity. Close defeat is predicted. I don't know about that. Continue the siege for now. We're not actually going to try to starve them out. I mean, maybe. I don't think so, though. Uh, we've got some imminent rebellions because this is too high up. Let's go ahead and drop that. Please go away, rebellions. Dong high. Okay. That's fine. What is the problem here, actually? Faction support and population, but... Not really looking to waste money with uh, growing the, the the city just just right now. And rush you down a little bit. Let's see, if this army were to attack anywhere, it's pretty badly hurt. The city of Guanling has okay defenses, I suppose. This is a long way away. Again, alright defenses. Though I guess I'm not too concerned about that. Two turns to get there. Two turns to get there. I'm gonna rush down. We're gonna take that farmland. Before they get another massive army in there or something crazy like that. Alright, uh, I'm wondering if we go into money saving mode. Spy events. A little bit of moving around going on. Kingdom of Ba. Yeah, seems very, very, very small. Very tightly packed. And around the Kingdom of Wei as well. But there's no way they're gonna hire... Um, our people. Yeah, yeah, that, that pun was intentional. There is no way. Damn right it was intentional. Looks like they're moving towards a small city over here. Up over here. We could rush over to Luoyang to try and defend it in case these guys get any wise ideas. Where the hell is... Okay, look. It says this garrison has... Did the replenishment just help us or something? Was I... Like, it, this is not the army we were fielding during that battle. Jesus, so many wars. I think Lu Su needs to come down south. I think Lu Su needs to rush down south, if I'm honest. Well, let's go ahead and march you down south first. Because what I want to do is I want to get to Sanyang. Go ahead and march you down here. See what the enemy's up to if we can. Hello. Okay. And again, hopefully we're going to draw them up over here, right? I doubt they want uh, peace yet. A bit more reasonable. Okay, a bit more reasonable. I just want to not have a front to fight. I, I want to reduce how many fronts I'm fighting on. Thing is, they have money and food. Why do you have so much goddamn money? Why do you want more? I could give you stuff and things. I have a lot of crap just laying around, don't I? I do have a lot of crap just laying around. Close, okay. See, the only reason for this piece is because it's... Everywhere. It's everywhere. So I might might pressure that piece out. I'm wondering if I want to take this stuff first. Like, I'll go to war with them later. 
There's no doubt about that. I want that lumber yard back. I'll go to war with them later, but for now, maybe if we can just have even a temporary peace. Right? More ancillaries. Oh, I don't know about that bow. I don't know if I want to give you that bow. Go ahead and take that. Take that. Take the Book of Songs. Oh. These are all cool things I don't want to give up. And maybe some more money. These guys are just money hungry, aren't they? Alright, if we pull it down to like say here. And then we offer food trade. I doubt it's going to make a difference. Yeah. And offer regular payments. What I'm hoping is we just go to war with them soon enough before regular payments are done. Ah, oh, this is starting to get too expensive. This is starting to get way too expensive. Maybe we have to just battle them a bit more first. I don't have room for that kind of wasteful expense. Okay. You are going to destroy this army. Punish Dong Tang for even trying to take the Silk Trader here. Of course, they're going to be cowards. But then hopefully we can... We're basically at full health. Let's go ahead and rush in here just in case they try again. Cool. Ma Dai, we're going to pull you down south. I feel like rushing you down south. There are a couple of armies here, but they're not big armies. Yep, let's rush you down south. As far as you can go. Hold on a second. Isn't that as far as you can march? Basically. So fine, we'll march you up to there. I want to use him to protect uh, the trade port at Luoyang and Hedong and then and then move up from there. This is a lot of armies clumped into one spot. And you, Tai Shi Tzu, in two turns you can get there. Do we have to replenish? A little bit. So let's go ahead up to here. Hmm. Here, let's go ahead up to there. We're just looking for a spot where I can also set up an ambush. Because I might as well. We are on my side of the boundaries, right? We are still getting the replenishment. Ambush stance, just in case something's coming from over there. Alright, over here, well, hold on. Yeah, I'll deal with this first. We have night battles, yes. Go ahead and attack these guys. Close defeat is predicted. We get a night battle, a close victory is predicted. Because the next battle is an open field battle as well. So let's go ahead and do a night battle here. Devastate these guys. Try and take minimal losses. And then uh, move on to take that uh, settlement back. But yeah, we're going to fight this one for sure. Go ahead and start the battle and see what we can do. Went from the D fence to the A fence. Jeez, I need to come up with some better puns here. All right. Should be a good time. Uh, they have a fair number of archers and stuff as well. But it's okay. We outnumber their archers like... 20 to 1. Exaggerating, of course. Pull back a little bit. Let's go ahead and get uh, you guys up front. Boxed up, of course. I need to adjust this army. This army's a bit of a mess. This army's a bit of a mess. I get you guys set up like that. Go ahead and get all of our archers and our crossbows. Set up back over here. This thing, I need to... I need to split them up. Okay. You are our cavalry. Right? Did leave any cavalry behind? I did not. Okay. You two. We can maybe put on this side as like auxiliary cavalry. And you. Let's go ahead and spread like so. Like so and like so. Just so that they're able to fire in different directions. Because otherwise we keep um, rotating into our front lines and stuff. Go ahead and line you up over here. Unfortunately, no flaming shots, but it's okay. Our bouncing shots should cause a fair bit of hurt before these guys can close the gaps. Get you set up as well. All right. Got room to move. Yeah, we can move through there. I'm wondering if I want to put them into cover or something instead. I'm in barreling from over there. Nah. All right, good enough, I think. Set up. You're set up, and you're set up. Let's, uh, let's begin. 
Fire away, no time to waste. Try and get some work done over here. Words fly, so do rocks. Come on, baby. Give me some good shots. Here we go, here we go. One guy got ripped in half over there. Beautiful. Got that pretty nicely. Yeah, those were some good hits. Should maybe take care of the pearl dragons up there. Archers are terrifying, though, is the thing. The pearl dragon block chance is pretty high, but our archers should be able to whittle them down a little bit. That range is ridiculous. Keep firing, come on. Keep those shots coming, let's break them. Gong Lan Shu will be gone, Lan Shu. Alright, here we go. Shots coming through. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Couple more shots. Uh, cavalry coming over there, I don't like that. Now, our cavalry will out outperform theirs, no doubt. Still don't like it, though. Okay, good hits. Let's go ahead and turn our attention to you. You're still clumped up. Are they just setting up over there? That'd be a weird spot to just set up on. Come on. Here we go. Oof. Beautiful. <laughs> Loose formation order given now. It's just like, yeah, that could have come a little bit sooner. Pretty badly hurt. Everything else is... Loose formation. We have one shot over there. Could get a lot of work done, so let's try it. Just for one volley, and then one volley over here as well, because again, it could get a lot of work done. They're literally just camping out over here. Ah, oh, there we go. That was bad. That was nice. <laughs> Looks like they're loosening up. Hey, okay, fire over here. They're taking care of their archers again. Almost able to fire over here. Low fire arrows. Okay, artillery is firing over there. Go ahead and fire at the archer militia over here. Scare them off. These guys are hopefully going to get stuck in. You fire at the pearl dragons. You're firing up over here, actually. Big clump. Come on. Pearl dragon just not quitting, eh? You gonna get some shots here or what? Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing? What are you doing? firing over here. Go ahead and pull these guys back a little bit. Not a fan of what's going on over there. Charge you in here. Push you in here as well. Gonna eat some charges down here. Firing up there. Let's go. Eat some charges over here. Can we turn you around. Let's go. Get a good charge in here or two, we'll be fine. Here comes a cavalry charge. This we won't be fine against. Oh, we're gonna eat a lot of hurt there. Okay, not the end of the world. Good there, let's move up. Pull you back, pull you back. You firing up there. Get your loop around back. Some good charges here, come on. And you up there. You up behind these guys. Got a nice rear charge over here. Let's get you up over there. Come on. Running out of ammo now. Done okay over there. Let's pull back. Pull you back. Let me go with the charge over there. Okay, good stuff. Pull you back. Pull you back. Let's go. Firing away still. Firing... Over here, perhaps. Get you in with the rear charge. All right, good stuff. Charge over here. Yeah, looks like a decent charge. Good stuff. Get into these guys. Chase after him. Keep you firing up there. Get you firing up there. 
ahead and send our cavalry up as well. Gotta do some cleanup now. If we can. These guys are taking a fair bit of hurt. I know this army <laughs> needs to be fixed up. Definitely needs to be fixed up. There's the victory, so that's all good, but trying to eliminate these guys as best as possible. Hold your fire, hold your fire. E10 is going to fall. These guys are going to eat a nice rear charge. These guys aren't going to have a good time either. We have to eliminate the army because otherwise uh, they will harass us afterwards on the campaign map, of course. Alright, good stuff. Chasing up there. Yeah, there's a lot of G Militia up there. Let's get you up there. Oh yeah, you stay up there. Alright, alright. You guys are moving up. Speed it up a little bit. Let's see them nice charges. Come on, poke, stab, kill, take. Or just kind of slowly... Slowly march into them. That works too. Alright, gonna speed it up. I think we've wiped enough of them off. Ah, there's quite a few of them back there, actually. A lot of the Archer Militia have survived. But I think we can call it over here, folks. Yeah, let's call it over here. Claim the victory. A decisive victory. Beautiful. Might take the replenishment off of here. I wish I could just get them to give up. Just, like, confederate. Come on. <laughs> just do it. Just do it. Some good kills, actually, over here. Strategist versus strategist fight. They're like twins. Okay, did well enough. Go ahead and take that replenishment, I think. Yeah, I think it's a good call. Push them back. A rare talent. The war brings chaos and disharmony to China. There is glory to be gained in battle all the same. As warriors clash on the battlefield, the victorious cover themselves in glory. One particular warrior excels, a unique talent that you would do well to keep close. Oh, well, sure, why not? I can afford that. <laughs> now. A Pyrrhic victory is predicted. Make it a night battle. Demand surrender. No. The last settlement, I guess. I don't make it a night battle. Okay. The reinforcements aren't going to be there. So let's make it a night battle. And uh, let's, uh, let's dive on in. Make this a slightly longer session today. Why not? Do it. All right. Again, open field battle. Um, can't see the enemy, unfortunately. That's kind of really unfortunate. I could post up, like, over here. Oh, where are you? Don't be sneaky like this. Okay, all right, fair enough, fair enough. Get you guys all grouped up. My cavalry force. Go. Yep, that's all good. Uh, you guys... Yeah, I wasn't expecting not to be able to see the enemy. It's a bit of a dampener in my plans. Swords back here. Be back here. Oh, actually. Saw how that worked last time. Didn't really. With all these archers we have. Okay. Set you up like so. Group you and group you. Okay, good stuff. Get the trebuchet back over here. They need to be able to see the enemy. Otherwise, we're going to be in a bit of trouble. I could send some of my strategists up. To explore. Maybe send some of my cab up to explore instead. That would be the smarter move. I mean, these guys are able to push up, actually. I could, like, hide them in the trees over here, maybe. Or up over here. Be my forward scouts. See what the enemy's up to. And, uh, yeah, then pull back into safety. Sure. Move you guys all... Oh no, there's a boulder there. Probably use that to my advantage. The house there. Okay. Interesting. Interesting battlefield. Let's begin. There you are. Fire away. That is quite a few of them. Be back. Shots are coming through. 
Here we go. Bloodstained Snow. Nice. Very good. Very good. Those hits coming. Move my cavalry up over here. Those weren't the best hits. Our men are spotted. You don't say. As long as these men aren't spotted. Maybe attack the archers over here. Not really worried about the G militia. The archers are the scary part. A lot of archers. A good rear charge or two will do the trick though. One volley there and then we'll hit these guys. They're nicely clumped up. Ridge isn't helping my cause. I could actually send these guys up like so. Bit of a risky charge. Let's let one volley from the... There we go. Fire over here. Archers are able to fire at the Saber Militia, please. Cavalry coming up this way. Let's go. You guys coming this way. Let's go. You guys firing up there. Come on, break their spirit. Fire up there. Here comes a cavalry charge. We're good over here. Bring you down this way. Go up there, get you over there. Okay, good stuff. You guys are giving up. Fire away over here. Okay, good work. The charge over here, looks like. Done quite well up there as well. Oh, looks like we're about to eat a charge over here. Get up close and personal there for a second. Alright. How are we doing? Pull you back. Fire back over there. Fire back over there. Let's pull you up. Pull these guys out a little bit. We get another charge into these crossbows back there. Okay, good stuff. We're moving you up. Move you up over here. Get you out of there. There are spears here. Alright. This is over. In we go. Beautifully done. Given up. Firing up there. Firing up there. Get you firing up there. You see? Oh, it's because they're out of ammo. Fair enough. Hey, okay, move you up here. That's all the killing that needs to be done, I guess. Because again, it's a it's a city battle. So nothing to worry about after this is done. Who is still fighting? There we go. I was like, what? What is going on? Go ahead and take that victory. Thank you very much. A decisive one indeed. A decisive one indeed. Just a three minute battle there. Nothing too crazy. Nothing too crazy. God. Finally want to wipe these guys off. Unfortunately, that army still stands. That's why I was checking for the night battle if I turned it off. If it, Whoa, that looked like a very temporary piece of art. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's why I wanted to see if the reinforcements would actually help if we didn't make it a night battle. Go ahead and occupy. Because now, unfortunately, these guys still stand. And I can't attack them this turn. Now, who's upset? Are you upset? Yeah, you're upset. Gotta keep these guys happy. There you go. That helps a little bit. You've leveled up as well. Flaming shots, I do believe, are in order. Hold on. It's her yen. Flaming shots for the retinue, so... Pointless. You need the flaming shots. So close. We're so close. It's okay. Uh, we can go ahead and get this instead. Judgment. Extra cunning. Extra range damage. Boom. Done. Should maybe give him a promotion, I think. Maybe give him a promotion. Could maybe give him the Cinnabar Red Bow as well. Extra extra cunning. Lots of extra cunning. Alright. Those are your rewards, buddy. This army is the last army left from uh, Gonglang Shu. And then down south over here, we need to get... Oh, there we go. There we go. 
need to get aggressive over here, I think. I think we're going to assault the walls. I don't think we'll just starve them out. I don't think we'll let them sally forth. The garrison over here. Uh, it's kind of scary. Not gonna lie, it's kind of scary. I'll see. I'll have to make a decision over here um, soon. I'll have to make a decision down there very soon. Down over here as well, we gotta figure out what to do. Do we push south? Do we push north? Uh, we are able to take the livestock farm, actually. Oh, yeah, that'd be great. And then over here, next turn, we hit Guangling. All right, folks, that went pretty well, I'd say. This is a bit of a scary spot to be in, but uh, overall, that went pretty good. Pretty solid session. Hope you guys enjoyed it. As always, if you did, you know what to do. Drop a like, drop a comment. Let me know you would like to see more of War 3 Kingdoms on the channel. As always, a massive thanks goes out to all of my channel members and patrons for supporting the channel on a monthly basis. You keep us alive and running smoothly. And a big old thanks goes out to each and every one of you for watching. Until next time, cheers.